We're going to solve the 3 by 3 system of equations using the graphing calculator method. So here is our system right there. And we're going to create an A matrix by reading off the coefficients. Like that's a 1 right there. 3, 4, 1, 3, 4, a 4. Uh, it was, there's a zero here in front of the X. Zero, four, two, zero, four, two. And this Z equals four. There's zero in front of the X, zero in front of the Y, and a one in front of the Z. Okay. So the, that's how you get the coefficient matrix. It's got to be X, Y, Z. And if there's no variable, that gives a zero. So there's the A matrix that we're going to put in the calculator. And the B matrix is the answers, vector, 20, 20, and 4, right there. So here's how we do it. We take the uh, second matrix, scroll over to edit, and hit 1, which puts you into the matrix A edit screen, which is right here. Make it be a 3 by 3, because it's a 3 by 3 system of equations, and put in the coefficients. So you hit here, put the 3, you put the 3 here, you scroll, keep scrolling, put the 1, enter, 3, enter, 4, enter, 0, enter, 4, etc. Put all these in, and enter. Then you hit second matrix, scroll over to edit, and this and down to number two, and hit number two in order to get the edit screen for matrix B. Make that be a three rows by one column matrix, and put in the 20, enter, 20, enter, and four, enter. Then you do a second quit to get back to the home screen. There's your home screen that you have cleared off in blank. Then you hit second in, uh, second matrix. Uh, you stay at names. You hit number one to put the A matrix onto the home screen. And it looks like this. What's the A matrix right there? Then hit the X to the minus one key and the multiply key to make it look like this. Then go to second matrix. Put the B matrix on the home screen by choosing number two. Then it makes it look like this. Press enter and you get this screen here, which has the solution matrix right there. And that's x equals negative 5, y equals 3, and z equals 4.